All right, the Yak, Thursday, sponsored by Roback. I'm wearing the Roback joggers right now. They got the best joggers, the best hoodies, the best polos, crewnecks. I'm missing. Q-zips. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Q-zips. Q-zips, I appreciate that. They've got the performance joggers, all of it. Kick off your new year right. Use code YAK on Roback.com, R-H-O-B-A-C-K.com for a generous 20% off your first purchase. That's 20% off all performance hoodies, crewnecks, joggers, and more. Code YAK. One hey, of the problems. Oh, hey, oh. I was going to say, hey, Brandon, uh, you sitting with all your friends over there? <laughs> you fucking idiot. There's no one even sitting by you. Wait. Wait, wait shit. Wait. Shit. Wait. <laughs> wait. 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 Uh, wait. Never mind. <laughs> um, one of the problems with uh, the A New Untold Story podcast being 90% of the show this week is if they're A New Untold Story podcast, by the way, go subscribe, go like, go watch, go enjoy that show mm-hmm. all the time. It's one of the, I would say it's top three show here at Barstool. Mm-hmm. Anyway, one of the problems with them being 90% of the show is when they run a little long upstairs and their guest happens to be the same guest who's going to be on the act today. Yep. It's just me and you looking at each other, and we've already fucking We've already done, done this. We've, we've done already this done this show. Half. Yeah, yeah. For an hour and a half. I got nothing. You want to do it again? Bring us in. <laughs> Welcome to Mostly Sports. Uh, today is Thursday, February 15th. We are live from Chicago. What do you want to talk about, Brandon? Fuck you. That's what I want to talk yeah. about. So, Anus will be down shortly. It'll they're be, deep in the anus up there. They're deep in the anus. Yeah. Very deep. They get, the they get deep in the anus all the time. What do you want to do? I don't know. You want to, you want to arm us? We can do whatever the hell we want. We're doing a KB show today, right? Tickle fight. What do you think KB is going to want to do? Uh, I heard some planning earlier. It will be there. There is a plan. So is it physical? Is it mental? Is I think it... it's more mental than physical. Okay. But with Kyle, it could go from mental to physical in a, in a heartbeat. Okay. Uh, and I want to say the original, and and y'all correct me if I'm wrong. I think the original KB's wild was that the Joe Montana day. Was that was that what set up Zod to uh, to do the Goldberg thing? And that might have been KB's Wild two. That was KB's Wild two. Do you remember what KB's Wild one was? I want to say it was just a drinking thing where somebody was drinking like an orange I vodka think, mix. Or are you something. thinking? Of, you think you might be thinking of Juice is Wild? You're right. I might be thinking. No, Juice you're is Wild of, is when uh, KB OJ dumped Juice Chase. on him. No, 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 no. You're no. thinking of you're thinking of when OJ was in the white Bronco. You're thinking of John Elway. You're thinking of the, the white, white Bronco. Bronco. John yeah. Elway. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, John Elway. Yeah, White Mamba. Yeah. Brian Scalabrini. Yes. Right. Brian from Family Guy. So if you just want to put the slate up, and uh, as soon as they get here, we'll we'll go into the show. Uh, Got it. That's not – no, I'm not – okay, let's not do that. See ya. Wait, wait, uh, wait. <laughs> so uh, on Tuesday, big news here, uh, Big Cat will be back, uh, and also Dan will be back from his vacation. Both of them? Yeah. Big Cat uh, and Dan? I don't mm-hmm. get it. Kate's returning on on Tuesday. She's had two kids. She has a big pussy now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck, dude? <laughs> That's what we're on. <laughs> You've told a lot of bad jokes. I know. Today. I know. I knew she would be did back. You, did you expect me to connect those dots? I knew she'd be back eventually, so I was like, hey, Brandon, s- I made mental notes. The only I got one thing in my calendar on my phone. <laughs> Make fun of Kate's pussy. <laughs> was that was that publicly known? Did you just break news right there? Fuck. Yeah. Was it supposed to be a surprise? Fuck. It might have been. Yeah, I think it might have supposed to have been a surprise. Yeah. Damn. Yep. <laughs> well, <Yeah. there's- laughs> okay, let's go ahead and shut the stream down. Uh, whatever. Whatever. It is what it is. No, I think she tweeted about it, didn't she? Oh, did she? Or did she just text us? Oh, can we talk about something? I know something? she texted the group. Now that, we're, now that we're here together and looking at each other. Uh, Mantis was on the Yak the other day, correct? Remember? When I, I don't know. Was I, I wasn't here when he was on the Yak. Oh, that's fine. Mantis was on the Yak the other day. Does that does that now mean we're just, we're just boys with Mantis? Because this morning the first text we had was a new group that was created uh, by him right. called okay. Mantis and I the Yak. Get ease into the story. Um... I don't know how to ease into it anymore yeah, I than I already did. I, guess I can't think of a <laughs> right. better way. Uh, what is uh what is the backstory with Mantis? Because I, 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 I'm good enough at context clues to pick up on like he was very heavily involved in Barstool. Yeah, when well, he, he won Barstool Idol. Okay, and that was obviously what it sounds like. It was a contest to get a job. He won that, and then he worked here for for a while. He got in trouble. You're talking for, about the text we fucking got this morning. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So um. 
But he he got in trouble for like bringing a date to the office and showing her the office while we were doing a stream. Can we play that radio clip? He's just oh he he worked he actually worked it worked here, here yeah he, worked yeah, in the he New had York a job office for a couple two to three years. Oh wow yeah and then it just it just went south on him and um, I guess I don't remember if he got fired or like however the language was but then he didn't work with us anymore and he just caught on doing his own thing on the internet. Now he was here the other day but this morning we wake up. And, um, you know, we have a Yak group chat, and that's fine. We, we talk to each other all the time. But this morning, I get, I'm get i in a group called Yak Plus Mantis. <laughs> and it was at 1.13 a.m. this morning, this group was created. Uh, at 1.13 a.m., Mantis texted us, just get, all caps, just got head again, and pussy. Which is like pussy as the supplement is uh -huh. hilarious. It's the yak, <laughs> like and pussy. Like <laughs> 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 just got <laughs> just got head and pussy. also I got some I got some is pussy. Is that a shampoo? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and pussy. It. It's the yak. So I was like, uh, hmm. Man what is the yak? Named the conversation yak plus mantis. So then it went ten hours. Did I assume, yak get him I assume the yak got him pussy or he fucked someone who watched, listens to the yak or he fucked because of the yak. No. I guess he just yeah. wanted to tell us. Well, ten hours went by before anybody broached the subject. Like what? And then you, you, you got it. No one even like <laughs> stickered it. No, I, <laughs> I felt I was like, we got to respond. So, uh, yeah, I, I, I think you asked. Uh, I texted Kyle. He uh, last night. He responded to me at six a.m. He's like, I just don't know what to do with this Mantis text right now. <laughs> I think. I think is is your first reply a little insulting? Like like you said without too. much. Without too much detail, how did it go down? No, because historically <laughs> he gives too much detail. Okay, fair and enough. It repulses me. <laughs> and, and, look what, and look what he yeah. still did. I think he, gave too he much still detail. gave too much detail. <laughs> 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 what do you say? He still gave a little bit too much. Went to celebrate Valentine's Day with my ex, who I haven't seen since around Christmas, hung out, and pretty much had our official breakup sex. Only lasted like five pumps, unfortunately. Haven't choked the chicken in ages, but I was lasting well with the Colin Kaepernick. <laughs> that, that's two to three standard deviations above uh, what would be an acceptable amount from my point of view. <laughs> I didn't need to know the pumps. You don't need to know pumps. You don't need lingo. No. Uh, you don't need time. You didn't want to hear about his dripping skin on top the, of her the body. Choking chicken. It, f it yeah. feels we like you didn't need to know the masturbation update for sure. Mm. Right. No, and also, I don't think it's relevant in any way. Like, masturbating regularly doesn't make you have more stamina when you're having sex with your ex. Yeah, I think a lot of people might think that, though. <laughs> He's a he's he's not so, quite developed enough. So I I'm still oh, oh, <laughs> brother you don't know the half of it. <laughs> I'm still in the introductory phase of Mantis, and uh, I'm still in the introductory phase, and I find him fascinating and sure. very funny. But From it a feels science like, standpoint, it feels like <laughs> you guys have a different view of him, and I'm it, it, I'm, I'm getting the sense that he's a flame that burns very bright, yeah, and burns out very quickly. Like, am I next week going to be like, all right, I've, I've kind of had my Enough. fill of Mantis? Because I'm, I'm right now, I'm like, this is you yeah, so more. fucking funny. And I respect that about him because he he has incredible comedic confidence confidence in himself. He tries a lot. He's a volume shooter. Yeah. And so, yeah, it could that could happen, but he's successful now on yeah. YouTube because of that mindset. Yeah, <laughs> yeah like he's his own... He's his own deal. Yeah. He's a very unique guy. <laughs> yeah. I like him. From, from, I think everybody yeah, likes no. him yeah. from a personal guy. standpoint. He's the oh, man. I do too, yeah. Yeah. I, I still love the opening text. Like, I got head and pussy. Like, it's a two for one. I think he might have hit send too early. He was like, fuck, I forgot to tell him about <laughs> pussy. <laughs> about to tell them my dick. No, I don't know that he did because he did put head in all caps and he, he just did the pussy. I feel like head was the highlight for him. Far and away the yeah. highlight for him. Mantis yeah. just Maybe. getting head and leaving would be the funniest. Maybe he was given a live update and he texted you, I just got head. <laughs> 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 and then he got some <laughs> Can we see timestamps? Yeah, we can. No, but I think <laughs> they're all, all, I think they're all texting as it's happening. 1 13 a.m. Head falls underneath the kitty cat emoji umbrella. You don't need to say both yeah, things. Yeah, right. If you say the cat emoji, we assume you did everything. You assume head with cat? Like, I don't assume I don't, head with cat. I don't give a shit. 
You know, yeah, that's, I'm like, I guess all right, that's you, the point. You got some action last night. You're an adult. Hopefully you had sex. Hey, Dan. You wouldn't be reporting this. Oh, you don't know him. Hey, hold, hey, hold, hold on, boys. Hold on. Hey, Dan. <laughs> hey, can you see me? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Look at this. I'm getting a, I'm getting a Manny and Petty. Oh. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Golly. Grossest toes in the world. Not anymore. <laughs> yeah, that's all I just wanted to say. I miss you guys. Hey, are you, uh, you hear you. about Mantis? Is he? He got his dick sucked. Is he coming back to Barstool? Oh, no, he's no, in the head and pussy busy club. right now. <laughs> he's gonna live there for a couple of weeks. He could be somewhere. Oh, he might be here. Oh, he might it, be here. He did ask me if there was a bed here when he no, no, got no. done. No, no, no. I told him where our bed was. There's a bed here. All right, you haven't you haven't got Dan, are you are you hung over? Are you hung over? Yeah, I'm hungover, and also the the sun hasn't come out yet, so that's kind of I want a refund on that. But tomorrow oh. the sun is gonna come out. Well, that's All good. Right. That's good. We'll get get yeah. some uh, right, relax. First day, I miss you guys. Yeah, I'll miss you, you more. Mm -hmm. Sun's out. Yes. Yep. All, All right. right. See you, Dan. See you, Dan. Later. Later. Good luck on your special. Thank you, brother. Appreciate it. All right. All right. See you guys. Later. Later. <laughs> oh, he oh, I forgot yeah. about now, big fat ass. Brandon. What? I don't want to throw you under the bus. Yeah, no, no. I, I volunteered my bid. But Tuesday, uh, after the act, Mantis was like, fuck, like I've been up for like, you know, 24 hours after a long drive here, like all night shooting free throws. He's like, I got to get some sleep before I drive back like to Indy. It's like four hours or whatever. And Brandon's like, I'll get you a hotel. Oh, Brandon, that's yeah, nice. That and nice then, of you. But then Mantis was like, are you sure? Like, that's so nice of you. And Brandon was like, I didn't actually think that you were going to follow up on that <laughs> offer. No, 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 no. What I said was, uh, I didn't think you would say, say yes, but there's a there's a room upstairs with a bed. Yeah. If you want a hotel, I'll get you a hotel right now, or you could take that. Whichever one you want, make that decision. He chose the room. I was going to get him. I would have gotten him. I, I think you would have, too. But it was yeah. it was funny watching the I didn't think you were going to say yes interaction. Yeah. You were going to throw me out of the bus saying one, uh, a very, very nice thing that I did. It was very nice. I was an incredible guy. That was good manners. That Because you know you're offering the hotel, but the right. right thing for him to do is to accept the existing bed. Yeah. Yes. Everybody acted properly there. Yeah. And uh, he did take the bed, I believe. Uh, although I went up to that bed a couple about an hour later because I wanted to see him, and uh, and he wasn't there. So I don't know where he disappeared to. <laughs> mm -hmm. No, I, lo I lost my wallet that day. So I had to recover my steps. It was just actually just sitting here in, in this chair. <laughs> but I had to re retrace my steps, and I went to that bed, and I was going to wake him up to get my wallet, but I didn't have to because he wasn't asleep. I have a, a very similar Manta story to the one you guys just told from uh, the free throw competition. So You uh, have a very similar story to him getting head and pussy? Yes. <laughs> what? Yes. Okay. okay. Proceed. <laughs> So I think it was like during the one of the dinner shifts or something like that when people took a break and um, we're on the couch and uh, a phone starts going off for the FaceTime and it's Mantis and he, he's calling and, uh, you know, Dave tells him to come down. So then he's like, send me the address and Dave's not from here. So he hands me his phone. And he goes, hey, uh, text Mantis the address. So I started to put it in and I can't help but see the like all caps text from before their last interaction oh that's right <laughs> oh no oh, <laughs> and <laughs> i started cracking up and then dave was like what are you what are you doing and um i showed him that what the text was and it was from years ago but it was just like i got head for the first time just <laughs> it to dave? wait he sent it to portnoy to dave <laughs> just wanted to say like thank you so much or whatever and i forget what the rest of it. it was like three sentences but then <laughs> Dave's response <laughs> just said congrats, but it never went through. <laughs> <laughs> and that was their last correspondence. <laughs> and so I sent him the address, and we just had a good laugh over that. <laughs> oh. Mantis. Was anybody up at 1.13 a.m. when he sent that originally? Did no, I woke no. up to it. I, okay. was, I woke up to it. You, so you saw it last night? Yeah. That being the first I thing I see in the morning. Also, why did he, go did he have your number or did he piece together that group himself? Yeah, we exchanged numbers after. Okay, yeah. all right. Titus, you didn't get in that group. No, I'm not in okay. that group, yeah. yeah. Which, that makes you like I'm, him more. You want him yeah, more. Yeah, I know. That's why yeah. I'm like, yeah, Mantis rules. They, for him to have the good sense to not put me in that group tells me he's a stand-up guy. Because <laughs> I do not want to <laughs> well, be in that He just doesn't do have not, your number. I do not want to be in that group. I'm all for the updates, honestly. Yeah, no. I want, yeah, I guess I would, I, I am curious. Vague updates. <laughs> do, okay, so do, <laughs> 
do y'all want to use that group to report when we all get head and pussy or just mantis? That my we should start a group on stop. Hold on, hold on. Yeah. Great idea. We this should is... start a group that's like I just got head and or pussy, <laughs> <laughs> and that's the only thing we say. <laughs> The only texts you're allowed to send to the group are, I just got head or pussy. All caps head and or then, cat emoji. And then if you're responding to it, you have to respond only with the double taps. Yeah. Like a okay. thumbs up, I'm with yeah. exclamation right. point. Strictly business. Mook, you strike me as Nothing an updater. Uh, and pussy I, let the, I let the boys know. I don't mind getting an update on my boys. <laughs> I let the boys know. Let the boys yeah, know. I, I love knowing. I respect yeah. that. I respect I, I'll that. never tell you guys. I could be getting head right now. <laughs> you wouldn't know. <laughs> um, so last we left off, Kyle, you hit the name wheel yesterday. Yeah, and then I just remembered this morning. Mm -hmm. um, I think I want to do a game, The Celebrity Guesser. Okay. But, not, but with more side quests so we can accumulate points by guessing something that doesn't necessarily In the involve... Game guessing the specific celebrity mm. okay more more detail yeah i gotta i gotta invent the game real quick <laughs> okay all right. <laughs> all right you can get one point all right for guessing the correct well help me out here profession uh race career, career genre race, non-white no you can still guess white i think we play it like yahtzee so as soon as like we all have a list of things we have to get. The first person to get five of these things wins. Does that mean we're, we're, we're not guessing, we're not saying next will be a white guy. We just say a white guy, and it happens to be a white guy that counts. That counts as one of your checks, yeah. Okay. That seems too easy. It does seem, because white guy's going to be guess, off the I think you could, if you guess a non-white a non, a non -white race Paraplegia. and get it right, that's five points. If you guess the correct career, mm -hmm. that's one point. So if I say Whitney Houston and it's Mariah Carey, I get a point. They're both singers. They're both. So black, wait, are we guessing a person? Women. Well, it's you, your, I'm sorry. It's your we, game. I'll uh, shut yeah, up. I'll shut no, up. No, no, no. I'm sorry. I should have fleshed this out. We, dead. We can flush it out right now. Dead. Dead, is dead, dead should points? be a thing. Dead is a category. But what if you guess how they die? Do we do we have that information? We could probably we could. know if it we says could. if we get JFK, we know. Okay. Or do we? Do we really know? Yeah. We know. Uh, we know how. Do we? We, well, we know. Yeah. We or know do we? We don't. We, we don't have to say who mur. We don't, you don't have to guess murderer. Okay. Or assassin. You could guess murderer. You could, I guess. Can we add a uh, head and pussy element to this? <laughs> okay. You can guess. You can do, you use a golden fuckable. And <laughs> golden one fuckable. Golden fuckable. And it, if the person you guess golden fuckable, and if the, the next person comes up, we all have to vote honestly. <laughs> is that person fuckable? <laughs> like, do we want to fuck that person? Okay. Okay. Yeah, but this is like honor based, and that I promise I won't fuck you and guys that's over. That's ten points. Okay, this is awesome. Hitting uh, the golden fuckable is ten points. Mm -hmm. And then hitting the name, it, you win. Is a game ender. It's a game ender. Okay, I like it. I love this game. Yep. Still, still don't know how it works. I assume you also retain the ability to change rules as as we go along. Yeah. Yes. Okay. <laughs> we can do a, a practice run to see if we... Are we all going at the same time or one? No, one, it goes one to the next. Starting with you and then going around like we always do. Yeah, let's do a practice run. Yeah. Mm. Let's see you ever been here for a celebrity guesser? No, I I was watching that day, though, okay. uh, when you guys hit it. It was it was awesome. Have we done it twice? Where were you watching from? <laughs> yeah, so... <laughs> uh, <laughs> oof. <laughs> I was I was having my morning breakfast in Los Angeles. Um, oh. Yeah, just starting the day. Sunny, very sunny day. Got yeah. the backyard plucking avocado. Yeah, yeah. You weren't near the beach. Though. You could hear the, the ocean. Uh, I had to turn it up because the waves, the sound of the waves were so loud. Um, wow. It sounds nice. Yeah. Was anybody else You probably could breakfast? smell the salt water. Yeah, yeah, you could actually. You could smell the salt water? It was wonderful. That had yeah. you, you had been feeling glee. It was a different life. <laughs> I was feeling glee. Yeah, I coming was. off head and pussy. Head and pussy. So why, why are you here? Uh, I thought maybe someday I'd have the opportunity to make a thousand free throws over the course of sixteen <laughs> hours. <laughs> <laughs> As my body deteriorates piss on live your pants <laughs> on live stream. <laughs> it pissed my pants. Um. No, the the one thing I remember watching on the Yak that I am really jealous of, but I don't. I mean, Case Race, obviously, but I know eventually we'll get to one of those. But yeah. the Fart Eliminator, I I remember watching that, and I was like, I would fucking kill that. I was not, but I don't want to. I don't want to like beg for us to do it. So it'll have to land on it naturally. Eventually, it'll come up, and I I think I'm gonna really 
bring you could do it i'm gonna bring some good stuff it's like the it. gauntlet though it's you think it's easier than when you're on the spot okay no 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 Ooh, yeah <laughs> that would have that been cool <laughs> oh jeff d wants redemption today too because the graphic no, he, came out he's there's no way he wants redemption. oh he's in shorts but what's redemption what's jeff jeff shoot that basketball right now yeah, right you're, now. you're right there. The ball's right, right there. Yeah. Just pick it, it up. might as well. From that right spot now. right now. One shot. One shot. One shot. M &M. For everything. One opportunity. For everything. To see. Oh. Oh! oh! Yeah! Yeah! All right, that counts. There we go. <laughs> Knock a minute off his time. <laughs> he's going he's gonna to get wheeled out of here in a wheelchair. <laughs> <laughs> My feet. <laughs> uh, when are we doing the, the case race? The Royal Rumble. I think it all, it, you know, it, it was supposed it, to be March, but now we had to move it because of Roan Sass can't make it. It all depends on, you know, availability of guests. I think. Okay. I think we are going to pare it down and make sure the core barstool people like Roan and Sass are here first. I would think wasn't the first ever case race for Sass's birthday in April, so yeah. April would make a lot of sense because I think that's Roan what's the and turnaround Sass's. time on uh, editing. TJ? About two, usually a day uh, or two. It depends. I, we've done it overnight. It but, should oh, really? be two days at least. Yeah. yeah, we we've done a case race on Thursday that aired on Friday. Oh, it was that's, very close that's to not getting up on time. Though. Yeah, I thought it was like a week or something. No, so it basically yeah. requires like quigs or somebody that's not participating to do an all night something like this the the plans we got with this it probably needs to be on like at least a wednesday night yeah. maybe a tuesday the night. last one we did on a monday oh yeah we no, released that one the next friday didn't we uh maybe i don't I, know I, we did three episodes on a monday oh that was the christmas episode yes that we did on yes. monday and then it came out the next uh the next friday i by the way i think that celebrity <laughs> where's he going randomizer <laughs> is gone what? No. If somebody could find the website, I cannot find the we website. We can't find the celebrity guessing game? No. That's horrible. Kyle, we might have a snag. This is more than a snag. We might have the celebrity randomizer might be gone forever. We can't find it. And by we, I mean TJ. Oh, I just can't be. By TJ, I mean we. Random celebrity. That's not it. That looks like. Hmm. Wait, what? how would that generate it? You just tell it what you want? I guess we could just do one of these and have it just be one. All right. Oh, that's that's who I was thinking. <laughs> Game over. Fuck. Well, I like just the name. Whoa. Try turning off your ad blocker, dude. I don't know. What does that say, wet or dry? What? Yeah, oh. That's a shortcut. Oh. Oh, I ah. see. Okay, that makes sense. Hmm. I thought it was a possibly a pussy thing. Oh. <laughs> I love that. So yeah. there's a we have an official that's an official top fifty now? Yeah, I guess we hit fifty runs. This is beautiful. I've been reliving people. it in my head all ever what since. What you could have done wrong or what, what I did wrong. What you did wrong? What I should have done differently. What did you struggle on? I think the the trivia, I just was like Oh, you were bad at bags, weren't you? No, I hit bags pretty Okay. I didn't like really struggle in any particular thing. I mean like my shots were all short. I clear you know. Mm -hmm. I would have liked to have the free throw warm up as well, uh, and the trivia just happened to get me. Yeah, it's it. That's a that's a luck of the draw kind of thing. Yeah, took me a while. In in Dan's big run, he had the easiest sporkle that we've ever had on there. Yeah, it was like eight, first first ten numbers. Yeah, it was like name <laughs> name teams in the NFC or something. Yeah, it was yeah. It, something that was perfectly suited for him. Which I mean, fine, but whatever. <laughs> I don't know if he'll ever be beat. He'll be beat. I he'll just be gotta beat. do it long enough. It can be done. We've had people on pace before, and then Sporkle gets them, or or whatever. Well, so did he in that run have the record Sporkle time? I don't know if he was. I know he had the he 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 did the first on bags, first on soccer, and then the set. No, he hit both basketball shots first shot, and then I think he probably had the record Sporkle time too. Because that might be where it, where the difference is, mm -hmm. the Sporkle. Some good goalkeeping was happening too. I He's thought I had worst. a couple of rippers. Yeah. Oh, you out. were you were pounding it. I was pounding. I was yeah. like, you guys got Buffon here, fucking guarding the goal. So he had a slump a couple of weeks ago where he was just letting goals in from everybody. So I <laughs> feel like there's some skewed. He was down. Yeah. He was down for some reason. He's yeah, improved. I think His maybe dog he was, was like getting pussy or something. Uh, yeah. Couldn't handle it. I, I've noticed something about him on mostly sports today. Jake Malisek was on mostly sports, and I believe he just actively tries attempts to repel pussy. I think he attempts to not get it because on Mostly Sports this morning, we were not even talking about anything. He just said, I have a small penis. He announced it. No, Out he, of nowhere? I think he's <laughs> realized that this tactic works. Okay. When he did the whole bit about not seeking out women at the mm -hmm. bar, 
I think that's the most. I told you everything he does is for pussy. Mm -hmm. He's a real. It ended up working. Real bad guy. But he's also posting like selfies with his dog. Yep. Yeah. Is he really? Yeah. Look at his Twitter. But he 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 captured it Happy Valentine's Day. All right. I need to see the selfie with his dog, TJ. I I want to see how. How thirsty is the selfie with the dog? Like, is it just, oh, here's my dog? Oh, no, that's I know. pretty bad. He's laying down. And there's space for somebody else. <laughs> He's laying down. Exclamation yeah. point. The dog is also in, like, a human yeah. sort of pose there. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> that one's rough. Oh, that's Scroll on down it. to some of the responses. That's on Hinge for sure. Oh, what are you two up to <laughs> tonight? The usual. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean, He said dude? the usual? <laughs> <laughs> um all right any updates on the uh, celebrity guesser i can't find it somebody can tweet it to me or something all none right of, none of these are the right one the chat's got to be on that maybe the, Is why, there a different one why would that have yeah. disappeared it was pretty well we could you just use a different one. innocuous mm. yeah just try a different one let's just i think with the proper point system and the proper point like someone keeping track of yeah. the score, I think it could be really fun. Yeah, I, I think doing like a haphazard, lazy run of it w- won't be. Mm-hmm. Let me throw this idea at you: Is it only celebrities that we could randomly guess? Because if if we can't find this one, is there like a random vegetable guesser that we could do or something? I or random that, anything? That would be a blast, yeah. Random vegetables <laughs> would be incredible. Mm. I could just think of a celebrity if you want. <laughs> I, uh, no wait. Uh, uh, no. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I kind of <laughs> love. I kind of yeah. love this idea. Think of a celebrity, then you tell us how how hot or cold we are based on what you know, which uh, could be skewed uh, from the norm. Yeah, let's just do it that way. We're all on a team when we're trying to figure out what celebrities in Chase head. Okay. Is it Doug Martin? You but you can't. <laughs> and then I'll yeah. give it to TJ so he can have the picture yeah, ready. Okay. okay. All right. All right. All right. Go ahead and y'all, y'all get. I'll give you thirty seconds, a minute to get that ready, and then we'll come back to you. Do I give any clues, or it's just random? Hot I think cold. we. No, it's hot or cold. That's it. We just say a name. We don't ask questions. We say a name, and you say hot or cold. Kyle goes first. You say hot or cold, and then I'll go, and then you oh, say. Oh, so it's okay. Yeah, got it. And then you're like okay. warmer, hot. All right. Yeah. How you cold. say how hot or cold? Like lukewarm, warm, scorching, freezing cold. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. Scorching, boiling. But again, we can't ask questions. We just no. have to say a name. Yeah. We have to figure out where. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, I love this. This yeah, is what I, I wanted. I like this one a lot. Yeah. <laughs> Random celebrity. What is he thinking? Why is it? Shouldn't he have had one? He should just have one. It is a football player. It has to be a football yeah. Who else does it? What's Brad have? Johnson? That's Brad. But after Brad Johnson, who's the second one going to be? Oh, shit. You just said Brad Johnson, and he just leaned over and changed it, I think. We've already made the selection. <laughs> oh, okay. Right, boy. So now, <laughs> the what, uh, let me get one point of clarification before we start. Uh, this can be any celebrity. Why correct? should he be the one clarifying? Yeah. yeah. Yes, a real person though. I don't want a character from a movie, Jay. I don't. All want right. It. And okay. Me, I need it. to know your yep. definition of a celebrity. Is is Cade Otten a celebrity? No, no, no. I. I uh... Household name, right? Uh. I mean, you know who this person is. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes. What yes. This is perfect. <laughs> 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 All right. All right, Kyle, start us off. Um, Vince Vaughn. Very cold. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Fuck. Um, fuck. Okay. So not not a white guy. Not a comedic. Not a comedian. Not an actor. Yeah. Very cold. I mean, cold. So, uh, I'll change it to just. Cold, I got it. Then. I got just it. Cold, nope. just cold. Uh, Aretha Franklin. Uh, warmer but still cold. Okay, <laughs> I got this. Yeah. Soldier boy. Cold. Fuck. Bruce Valanche. <laughs> <laughs> cold. Very cold. <laughs> Whoopi Goldberg. Warmer but still. <laughs> Cool. <laughs> okay. Whoopee. We've named every type of person. <laughs> <laughs> I love this game already. Lupita Nyongo. Warmer but cold. Who the fuck? Warmer what? than the what? last. Wait, so, wait, 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 so warmer. Yeah. So, warmer than Whoopi. Warmer so that than means Whoopi. Younger. Younger is correct. <laughs> okay. But yeah. it is. What do we think? Incredible. We can talk amongst ourselves, right? Or, yeah, we're in between yeah, rounds yeah, yeah. right now. Um, what do you think is the warm part? Is it? Black, a female. Woman? I think female. I think female. Female yeah. singers have been. Wait, let's inactive. test this out. Let's go. Black man, 
black yeah, yeah. So maybe white a, woman. He's a soldier boy. Occupation. Which go, one let's go. Let, wait, let's hit him with white woman. I'm thinking it's a woman. Okay. okay. Yeah. Maybe hat. Let me. What about Zendaya? Uh. That look to me <laughs> makes me think you don't know who Zendaya is. <laughs> He doesn't. Yeah, I, I, like, I, I, know, I kind of know who Zendaya is. She Are you was, sure you're thinking of the right Zendaya? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Uh, uh, I'm trying to figure out how to answer <laughs> that. Yeah. <laughs> Half, I think. Half right. <laughs> okay. What? Temperature check. No, no, that's actually a What is it? <laughs> Half right. Half right? <laughs> yeah. yeah, half wrong also. We're doing like a warp oh, scale. Cold or warm. Just cold or warm, dude. Lukewarm? I mean, I'm he's saying half warm. Warm temperature? Yeah, half half warm, half cold. Right. So um, it's either, it either got a race right or her sex right. Or so, one name. Or a profession, right? I think it's definitely a woman. Age range? I don't. Mark? Shania Twain. Cold. Okay, okay. interesting. Ice spice. Warmer, but uh, we're still cool. Warmer than Zendaya? Warmer than. Uh, uh, Shania Twain. Okay. This is definitely a black person. Nicki Minaj. Warmer. Warmer. Let's do. Okay, but he says Zendaya is half right. Yeah. Oh, I wish I had my well, how, back. I'm trying to think of how that would. Make I think it's definitely a musician. Yeah. So is it Left Eye from TLC? Warmer. Okay. Not there, wow. but warmer. Okay. The last three have gotten progressively warmer. Or correct. It's... Correct. I'm going off of like the last person. So I'm trying to go older. Ashanti. Yeah, and I went with somebody dead. Warmer. They, they can't keep getting yeah, warm. They, can. they gotta heat up at some point. Okay. Kyle. Ashanti's warmer. I got mine. I think I got it. Sierra. Uh, uh Russell Wilson's wife. Uh, yeah. Colder. Colder. Well, okay. <laughs> 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 okay. Okay. <laughs> Jennifer Lopez. Uh, cooler than Sierra. Hmm. Sierra. Give me. Are you doing research? What are you doing? Yep. Put the phone away. <laughs> no. 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 I'm not doing research. I just googled. Black, Black female women. musician. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's, that's cheating. How's that cheating? Lost that's a turn. Cheating. Lost a turn. Lost a turn. All right, I don't think it's. I don't think it's black. It might not be a black. I think woman. it's female musicians, and I think I'm gonna guess Lady Gaga. Cold. Yeah, dude. Because I said Jennifer Lopez. How are we going back to white right now? That's Lil crazy. Kim. Warmer. Okay. Much wow. warmer. Right. Wow. Almost oh. hot. What? Almost oh. hot. <laughs> almost. Almost. We're not. We're not there. You're. You're warm. Lauren Hill. Warmer, we we we're, so we're not we're not fully there. We don't have a full match yet. So we thinking like more of the hip hop, probably. Yeah. Hmm. But like half Zendaya. I have an idea. You do? Cause I'm lost. I'm just gonna go Beyonce. Uh, who was the last guess? We don't. Lauren Hill. Lauren, Lauren Hill. Uh. Neutral, like no change. Uh, Missy Elliott. Fuck. Uh, you guys are a little bit off on on one specific category. Probably not a rapper. I then? think maybe, I got, uh, I think maybe I not profession. Maybe it's not a rapper. Maybe an actor. actor. Give me a uh, Northwest. <laughs> That's Kanye West's daughter. Oh, um, <laughs> no. <Cold. laughs> okay. Alicia Keys. Uh, our, our best guess so far was I think whatever. No, no, no. You just say warmer. You don't do that. I, uh, I would like to know the, the best nor guess. The northwest war I'm warmer, but it's impossible to be. But you step, said you said we, no. After should we I step said. away from musicians? But you said yeah. yeah. So you let's said go ahead. Was the best women. guess so far? Let, but I like the era of Lil Kim. Right. Um. So I'll go Megan Good. Ooh, I, I, I'm not familiar with that person. Damn. Za. <laughs> Who's that? Can I show him the picture? I can't, I Is it your wallpaper? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> have, have show me, have I, show me a picture. I can't tell you. Is she, is she an actress? Uh, yeah. She's she was in Anchorman too. Was that her? Um, she was in um. I don't know who. Megan she's in my cousin Skeeter. My cousin Skeeter. Mm. Oh, well, you made that up. Pretty warm. That's the best guess so far. Okay, thank you. What'd you say again? Megan Good. Megan Good. What, Nia Long. 
Warm, very warm. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, all right, maybe even hot. Okay, we're getting there. <laughs> so hot, black, '90s, 2000s actresses. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Gabrielle Union. Love it. Great guess. Slightly cooler, but you're you guys are in the ballpark now. Okay. Tyra Banks. Yes. Very warm. Uh, very warm. Lady. Very warm. Very warm. Here we go. Some might say hot. <laughs> what you keep? You're the one saying. Yeah, you. It's yes, some. some might say. You're the only one that knows, man. <laughs> hot. 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 Oh man. <laughs> I don't have anything in the brain right now. I don't know. Hmm. You don't know black people. I don't know early two <laughs> thousand. You, you were googling black people. <laughs> well, yeah, he was. let's not get carried away here. Um, I want to say Medea, but that's not an actual. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> you got it. Yeah. Okay. Go to you. Pass. We'll oh. throw a guess out there. Tyler Perry. <laughs> <laughs> no, colder. Okay. Halle Berry. Uh, warmer than oh, Tyler Perry, oh, but uh, not the best it? guess was I think uh, what Titus or KB said. I, Nobody remembers what that. What was. did you say? Uh, Tyra, Banks, Tyra Banks or Neil Tyra Long? Banks and Tyra Banks. He said Gabrielle Union. Gabrielle Union. Um, so it would have to be. Hmm. Hmm. This is maybe the dumbest thing we've ever done, and I couldn't be more into I'm it. I'm very locked, locked in. I, I could not be more I'm into very it. very locked in. Because I do want to do another one. Yeah. Uh, Brandon, you want to take my guess? No, I just took Halle Berry. Uh, what? So ba Banks seems to have been the closest. I have Banks a guess. So it maybe mo um, talk models? Show host or mo model. A talk show host or model. Wendy Williams. Uh, cooler, cooler. Okay, so it's a model, probably. Naomi Campbell. There. Mm -hmm. uh, no. He doesn't know who that no. is. Yeah. No, okay. I do know who that is. Uh, cooler. The the two best guesses so far were Tyra Banks and Nia Long, and they do have something in common. <laughs> <laughs> I think uh, just should we just open the floor? Let's. Open I know it. what yeah, I know yeah, what they have in go common. Ahead. Go ahead. They were both on the Fresh Prince of Bel Air. Uh, I, I know, know it. Uh, I know it. It's Jada Pinkett Smith. No, nope. it's it's it. It can't be Karen Parsons. It's not. I oh, know, it's the other I one. I don't know the cat. Tatiana M. Ali. Yes. Wow. Oh, <laughs> wow. Wow. Ashley Banks. What? That. What a yeah, guess. Wow. Wouldn't what a guess. Would have never. never, would have never. Big <laughs> brain energy, dude. Brandon, you're the only one that would have yeah. got it. That was awesome. No, I'm not. I mean, Fresh Prince, uh, as soon as he, Tyra Banks and Nia Long were connected, yep. that's I easy. I remember Tatiana. Yeah, Ola. for you, that's what I just said. You're oh. the only you one that would have watched Fresh been. Prince? You're the only one that would have I did, been. but I wouldn't have known her. She was a singer, yeah. too, for a period of time, right? She also appeared, she had a guest appearance on The Cosby Show. She was one of Rudy's friends. Good old Tatiana Ali. All right, so y'all want to... Well, you want to bottle that, or you want to do it again? Oh, I, that was, that was I would love to do it again. I, would chat say it, DJ. Uh, I don't think a single person in the chat got that wow. right the entire time. They were spamming names. I don't think oh, one yeah. well, person. Let's I mean, I, let's be honest. That was hard. As so far as celebrities go, yeah. as far as celebrities go, saying Tatiana Ali that's a deep in cut. 2024 that's a deep is quite the, really deep cut. Yeah. Right, so that's one point for Brandon. So K KB, what are we playing to? Ten or? Ten. Oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, well, there are supposed to be like mini point systems, or you could, if you guess something. I would him. say, well, getting it right would be like five points. You guys yeah. getting the the hottest one with like a point. You're for, Kyle. You're the. the I know. The, yeah. No. I, I kind of had fun just playing the game. Assign points. Just, just, I don't think there. I think he's trying to say there are no points. Yeah, I think I think the game as is is pretty good. I think we're just right. playing together. Also, kind of like yeah. us versus Che. Yeah. We whittled it down mm. together. Let's see, like how we got to get it and how many. How many total guesses? You want to do time or guesses? Uh, what do you think the total? We went around what three and a half, four times there. Yeah, uh, maybe I think more uh, I, I think time, time, two, three, okay. four. Time. I think guesses. Want to do Six. like five minutes on the clock? So like 40, Give us 40 five minutes guesses. On the clock, I think guess uh, we could just rapid fire. I like guesses. We have to be smart about it. All right, TJ, you need a guess counter. What do you guys thought on that difficulty level? I think that was pretty hard. I think a little very hard, a little easier, a little easier, a little easier. Okay. Somebody that you are very confident that all of us will not only know, but be able to think of. Okay, got one. Like Sanjaya from American Idol. We <laughs> yeah, all know, like that would but be... we're not thinking of him. I Although I literally just said his name, so I was thinking of <laughs> <Yeah>. him. Yeah. <laughs> Sanjaya Malakar and his sister. <laughs> Zendaya. Sanjaya. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, that is. <laughs> this is a great game, Kyle. 
<laughs> um. All right, so you guys are crafting. Are we, it's us versus Che. We want to say 30, 40. How many guesses? I think do we? Thirty guesses. Thirty. Yeah. Th- we have to get it within thirty we guesses, or he wins. 30. That's five rounds, right? There's six of us. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah okay. But we can group things. five. All right. Um, Che, you got it. Yep. All right, so we're we're good to go. Yeah. So thirty guesses. Oh wait, thirty guesses or five minutes or both? thirty guesses. Thirty guesses. Okay. Kyle, get us started. Justin Bieber. Ice cold. Okay. Dale Earnhardt. And somehow colder. Oh, yeah, he's dead. <laughs> uh, Sean Kingston. Uh, cold. Oprah. Warmer than Sean Kingston, but still pretty cold. That, that would be hot. Or actually, with uh, Sean Kingston. Uh, lukewarm. Lukewarm. Condoleezza Rice. Cold. I like show host, I think. Uh, Dan Marino. Ice cold. Okay, so we're one round in, and we haven't narrowed down sex or anything yet. No. This is bad. No. Lindsay Lohan. Uh, cool. Still pretty cold. Whoa. Lisa Leslie. Uh, cold still. Hmm. Doctor Phil. Warmer in some areas, colder in other areas. Stone Cold Steve Austin. Cold. <laughs> hmm. Flavor Flav. Cold. Drew Barrymore. Getting warmer, but okay. we're still not warm. This is tough. The face we, isn't good here. We're boys. almost halfway. I know. Yeah, this is a disaster. <laughs> oh, boy. Um, <sighs> what do we each have? Three more go arounds? Yeah. yeah we're going to Oprah. Once we get, we'll start getting warmer. We're going to. He, he paused on Oprah and Dr. Phil both to like, cla- like, we weren't close, but he at least gave it some thought. So it could be a show host of some sort. Maybe a game show host. Oh, it could be show. like a. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I got my. Kelly Ripa. Okay. Warmer. Mm-hmm. What did she do again? Um, I would say I would say warm. Host. Live with Kelly and okay. Regis. Yeah, thought about him maybe. Uh, Bob Barker. Mm-hmm. Uh, colder in some aspects, but you're you're getting close. Warm. Uh, Steve Harvey. Uh, colder than. Um, Bob Barker. Ryan Seacrest. Uh, getting colder. I'm thinking it's a woman. Yeah. Uh, Vanna White. Got it. Whoa! <laughs> that was huge. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah. All right. Uh, to clear things up, I think Bob Barker should have been. Cl- that, that's yeah. pretty hot. <laughs> I, I said like warmer in some, but colder in some. So it's like he game show host, but. 17. Like we can make man. this a real game show. Pretty good. <laughs> this is incredible. <laughs> Pretty good. <laughs> Holy shit. Wow, Vanna fun. White. We were dead. We were dead in the water. That was really good. But yeah, the chainness of it makes it makes it hard. Yes. You have no idea what the fuck's going on in his head. Yeah. It's chain As far as... Yeah, the first two celebrities he thought of in the whole world were Tatiana <laughs> Ali and Vanna White. <laughs> I'm impressed. But his, his description of, of warmer or colder... It I, doesn't there's no rhyme or, no rhyme or reason. Yeah, yeah no. it does not necessarily <laughs> help at all. Because no, no. he's right. Bob Barker was on a competing game show. If I thought of Vanna White and you said Bob Barker, I'd be like, red fucking hot. (laughs) You're right. You're (laughs) almost there. there. (laughs) What what did you get? Lukewarm? Yeah, he's like, oh, yeah. Not the same person, really. Yeah. So. yeah. <laughs> Different. Therefore. It has to be the same. Not. Yeah, it has to be the same person to be hot. (laughs) Oh. If we would have said Pat Sajak. Say what you're going to say. Oh, that. You're right there. Yeah. (laughs) We're going again, right? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Good. This All is right. the most fun I've had on this show. What is uh? <laughs> do you guys want difficulty level similar? Or? Similar, similar, yeah. similar. I, I, and it could be someone well known. I'm satisfied with. <laughs> it could be like a super. Do we want to set? How many guesses was that? Seventeen. Seventeen. Like, is uh, do we drop stick it with thirty? Seventeen is gonna 20? be tough. Stick with twenty. No, I think thirty is a good 30? number. Thirty is good. If he hadn't guessed that, and okay, stick with thirty, but we're trying to break the record, right? Like we're one of trying to beat seventeen. Trying to beat seventeen. Ongoing record. Yeah. For the folks at home, the world record right now is seventeen in this game. 
you want to play at home? Uh, do we have callers? We'll have somebody play with us. All right, Shay, you got it? We're ready. <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> <laughs> All right, real quick, we're about to play after I tell you about Mango RX, the Yak, sponsored by Mango RX, your premier telehealth platform providing free doctor visits for a seamless healthcare experience 100% online. Explore innovative treatments and unique formulas that redefine how you approach your health care. Trust in the expertise of our board-certified physicians when purchasing any of our products. Mm-hmm. Somebody talking? I, I think I heard that. Uh, Mango RX combines hard science with innovation, ensuring the highest standards in healthcare solutions. Start your 100% free online consultation today. Begin your journey to better health with Mango RX. All right, Shay is the pick-in. Uh, I am ready, yes. Just say yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh, you know what? Y'all want to go counter? Yeah, we can go the other Let's way. Let's go counter. Yeah, sure. Julio, get us started. Okay. Kobe Bryant. Cold. Mm, not a great look. Because uh. <laughs> 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 uh, Kyle? No, uh, it goes to you. Yeah. Oh, it goes to me. Uh, yeah, I meant I meant uh, counter. Oh goodness. Though. Yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Tony Hawk. Uh, warmer than Kobe, but still cold. White woman. Yep. White white woman. <sighs> Katie Kirk. Cold. That's who I had in my head before. It's wild. <laughs> Carrie Underwood. Cold. All right, so man, maybe not ath- uh, a live athlete. Yeah, uh, I don't think it's an athlete if Bryant and Hawk are cold. Well, yeah. well warmer. So uh, if but so, that could it's an athlete. Or... Any athlete to me would be at least lukewarm. Yeah, but okay. Bob Barker didn't trigger. <laughs> <laughs> it triggered some warmth. <clears throat> Al Michaels. Oh. Uh, who was the guest before? Sorry. Don't Ca- know. Carry under. Just compare. Uh, I think just much, compare much the two. Compare it to your much warmer? answer. Oh, compare it to. Don't my go answer. off he the last answer. Yeah. Say just just based ah, off. Okay, okay, okay. Um, not really in the ballpark, but you're improving. Warm. Warm. Warmer, warmer, warmer. But then what? what? Oh, uh, sorry. Just compare. Not, not go off the last. Okay, so you're cold. You're cold. Cold. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> This is a mind fuck. What do we do with that? I have no idea. All right, Al Michaels is cold, yeah. but not. it seems like not incredibly cold. Like 45. Like a pleasant day in Milwaukee right now. <laughs> Owen Wilson. You're still, still cool. Cool. Hmm. So he's probably not an actor. Uh, using probably not an actor? I mean, nothing's triggered anything yet. Barack Obama. Cold. I think it's a white guy for sure. Dane Cook. Cool. <laughs> Stone Cold <laughs> Steve Austin. Getting very hot. Oh, oh fuck yeah. yeah. I knew a wrestler was coming. The Undertaker. Uh, still warm. Hmm. Vince McMahon. Uh, I mean, we're still warm, colder than Undertaker. Okay, so if Stone Cold was flaming hot, bald, bald wrestler, then it must be a a wrestler. Yeah. But if another wrestler wasn't hot, that doesn't make sense. He's still comparing it to the last one. He just can't stop. (laughs) Right. Let me try this. The Rock. That feels like it's it. That's it. We're hot, but we're not there yet. We're we're hot. Okay. Logan Paul. Cool. Cooler than, but like, we're still warm. Kurt Angle. We're hot. Oh. I mean, we're right around it. It's, it's, it's either it's Shawn Michaels. Uh, we're hot, but that cooler than. Bald wrestler. Uh, bald wrestler. Uh. Oh. Wait. The big show. We're, s- we're still... Titus, you have to get it right here. Hot, we're, I think you guys are going to need a couple more guesses. Maybe a dozen more. Do we think bald? Do you think it has to be? I don't know if it's bald. But if Kurt I Angle like and Stone like, Cold, what else? I like it's like S- that era. I like Cena. I think it's the era of when Che was... Yeah. However old he is. Uh, um, 
I bought Cena. I think that might be a little after. I'll go Triple H. <gasps> We're still hot. It's not. Ah, it's not you fuck. Hulk Hogan. Cooler. Okay. Fuck. Diamond Dallas Page. Cool. Uh. I was saying cool isn't cool guy. Cool, cooler, but like we're still we're still very hot, but still cool. We're still very hot, but still cool. But like cooler than Makes, yeah. I mean, all yeah. these answers are pretty much the same. Like I'm trying yeah. to. RVD. Pretty hot. Pretty hot. <laughs> RVD. How's RVD pretty hot? Don't know. This Maybe it got closer to this era. Maybe it's an ECW guy. Maybe I, it's an extreme guy. I think it's a guy who was active in like oh four. Mick Foley. Cooler than previous guests, but we're still hot. I'm not too familiar with wrestling. Who's yeah. the guy that murdered his family? Benoit. <laughs> Chris Benoit. Probably not him. No, no. Uh but that's not a guess. I'm not he didn't guess. He asked. Okay, okay. Triple H. Already been guessed. Hey, are turn. you serious? Pay attention. Who said triple H? He I did, did right beside you. You said Triple H? A couple, yeah. Jeez, All right, Benoit. Surprise. Give me Benoit. What? You, oh, but, no, no. What? Cold. He wasted a guess. Wasted a guess. <laughs> oh. oh, my God. Um. Let me throw an idea. No. Oh, wait, what? What? Yeah. Can we <laughs> help? Give me, or? Give me some we're, hot, yeah. we're hot on... We're hot. I don't know era. We're hot on wrestlers. Right. Is it necessarily a male wrestler? No. We might just be hot on the era. And the profession. It might not be a dude. China? I don't, I don't know. know. I, I, I'm just I'm, I'm throwing that out there. Why don't we just throw a woman? Throw a balloon out there. Throw, throw a test balloon. That's a good guess. Trish Stratus. Cooler. Okay. Wow. All right. All right. Fine. 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 Hey, we had to. I look like God. a fucking idiot. I'm running no, no, out no, no. of wrestlers. You, I look like the biggest idiot. It was so, uh, Ric Flair too old. Uh, probably, probably too old. Too old. Yeah. Yeah. Let's find out. Uh, what's the gold? Uh, Goldberg? Gold Goldberg? Goldberg. Goldberg. Goldberg's not bad. Um, warmer than Trish. We're still, we're still Shit. in the ballpark. It's a dude. It's, it's a dude, Brandon. It's a dude. It's the hottest we got was Stone Cold Steve Austin. Yeah. yeah but so who would that be? We guess. In, fairness, in fairness, I think he was the first wrestler suggested. Okay. We I'm, haven't tried Cena. We haven't yeah, tried. Cena. I thought we have tried Cena. No, we no, haven't no. tried Cena. Do you guys want me to? Um, it's it's your guess, man. Well. I think it's worth John Cena. Uh, no, cooler. Is it X Pac? X Pac? How do you say it? I don't think. Yeah. And also, are we sold on white wrestler? I will say, someone in chat just got it for the first time. Hmm. So has it got to be obscure or uh, Sting? Uh, we're still a little bit. Fuck, cool. dude, this is this is brutal. Uh, sure I sh I should extend you guys a couple more guesses. No. This is pretty hard. No. Oh, it's hard. Well, Val it's Venus. Getting. All right, so it's a bald getting wrestler. Hot, getting hot. That, no, that's the hottest guess so far. Val Venus is not bald. He's that, a porn star wrestler guy. Oh. Val, it can't be no. Val Venus is, is too edge? hard for future. Is it Edge competitions? Okay. We don't. I don't I know feel, that person. I feel like. Every, you don't know Val, Val Venus? Venus is a wrestling porn star from 1998. Okay, so yeah, that's too hard. He wrong. It's got to be some someone that everyone knows. But he okay. said we're hot. All right, well, let me let me walk y'all through the 1998 era of wrestling. Who was the guy that had like the sun tattooed around his belly button? Reggie Miller. No, that's uh. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Who was that guy? That's uh, Batista. Yeah, that's Batista. Oh, is it Batista? But anyway, um, so we had a wrestling porn star. We also had a wrestling pimp back then. Who brought hoes to the ring? Godfather. Oh, Godfather. So, so I don't know if that was the hottest guess. The the next from from pimp, from porn star should be pimp. If if unless he, Edge if, the rated R stupid. If he superstar. followed up Vanna White with Godfather, <laughs> we have to fucking kill him. We have to. We, I don't know. I don't. We have to kill. Because we said make it easier. Yeah, we said make it easier. Godfather. 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 All you gotta do is remember that the the best guest so far is the wrestling porn star. So but I don't. Oh, Rikishi. <gasps> We've got two guesses left. They're over here. What do y'all want to do with them? I'm going to spot you guys half a round bonus three, uh, to go that? to 33. This this is a bit harder. <laughs> Didn't we say... We said you were right around the right difficulty, and you... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I thought in, in my scale, that, that's pretty equal. Well, we'll decide after we get it, because we're right around it. Yeah, we could end up being very mad at Shay. Do you want to give me the pimp? The Godfather. The, the Godfather. Uh, you need to oh, talk to us. Uh, no, uh, we're still... Is we're it still, warmer? Still hot. Uh, it's it's a little bit compared to Val Venus. It's 
pretty equal. It's a little bit cooler. You think Val Venus is the closest we've got? Val Venus is the closest you've got. He said it was. Okay. Based on what? What else about Val Venus? Alliteration? V's? He went out. Um, stringy hair. Once got his dick chopped off on live TV. Who got their dick chopped off? Val Venus. The guy choppy choppy just pee pee. Oh, man. Who's I'm at a loss here, boys. I, I, Henry, uh, you know, if you don't know, then Mark I think Henry? who else there is from that. Here's where I think we are. I think Val Venus is the closest guest. I think his celebrity isn't really that close to Val Venus, or as close as he is letting on. I think he's, I think he's just being Che right now. Yeah, that's. And I think we've probably been closer before, but that's just me trying to pick up. The like you think it's going to be like Johnny Knoxville because Val Venus got his dick cut off and Johnny Knoxville. <laughs> 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 TJ's validating it's the, the wrestling and... like hot and cold. So okay. We're... okay. Oh. All right. I don't know, Mark. We G- got give we... me some. Give me some guesses. Three more guesses. Okay. Well, I'm trying to think of wrestlers from that. I era. said Godfather, and then I said what else? Chris Jericho. We haven't said Mark Henry. I'll tell you who we haven't said. We haven't said Kane, but I don't know Kane. how how Val Venus yeah. would have been the hottest towards. KB Kane. brought up Rikishi as well. Rikishi, Rikishi. was a, Rikishi's a, a, a name worth guessing. Fuck it, I'll do it. Rikishi. That's as hot as we can get without hitting on the head. I don't know. Yeah. So, uh, is there a what is what's he, the sock guy? Oh, he wore a thong. Rikishi wore a thong. That was Mick Foley. Doesn't Rikishi that. have kids? Rikishi has kids. The Usos. Oh yeah, you're right. But why would Val Venus be close to the Usos? It has to be that era. Who is Rikishi's partner or nemesis? Well, he or? he wrestled with 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 too much, uh, too cool. But it was Scotty too hotty, and it was oh Scotty too no. hotty. Got it. Hey. <laughs> Oh my God! Yeah, I do know him. Never heard of that. Hey, all right, I oh, no, 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 no. That's insane, ridiculous. Shane. That is ridiculous. <laughs> Absolutely. Hey, I mean, yeah, that go, is not on the level of Vanna White. You can not go from Tatiana <laughs> Ali to Vanna White to Scotty. Scotty Too Hot. <laughs> That's ridiculous. <laughs> Fucking insane. Scotty Too Hot. is a hilarious. Uh, oh. <laughs> And yet I love this game. So. I know. Oh my god. <laughs> Thirty-one. Should we, all, should we all think of a of a person and oh, we all want to have a turn. I want I want to have a turn as the person. That's Why don't fine. you take a turn as the person? You go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead, Nick. All right, start. All right. Well, you know you got to go tell TJ, right? So so it, go tell TJ. Or I, I not don't really. No, not really. It's, not really. That's just a Che fail safe. Okay. <laughs> and then Che is taking and your spot. Che, guess. yeah. Okay, so I don't know if I want Che. <laughs> you got your guy. Yes. Or, yeah, you I want to hear person? Che's guesses for yeah. sure. All right, so we're gonna start with Kyle. And when we get through Julio to go to Che instead. Okay. Uh, Kyle, start us off with a guess. <laughs> I have a feeling he's going to get it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Howard Stern. Cold. Hmm. King Henry the Eighth. Freezing. Okay. He's just doing tricks on it now, little bro. <laughs> Jacob Elordi. That's not a person. Cold. He's the person. Okay, that's not a person? <laughs> uh, yeah, he's not. He's a god. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Pretty <laughs> Greek <laughs> god. Uh, Miles Teller. Cold. Uh, O.J. Simpson. Slightly warmer, but cold. He wouldn't take a bath in it. <laughs> Pokey Reese. Same temperature. Hmm. Carrot top. Cold. Danny Glover. Slightly warmer, but uh. wouldn't bathe. We haven't gotten a bath yet. No. Idris Elba. Same temperature. The Bachelor Zach Shawcross. Cold. <laughs> Dak Prescott. Same temperature as Idris Elba. Okay, we need to go female, I think. Ashanti. Warmer. Warm. Black woman. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Fuck. Vet warm. Ashanti's warm. Um, Missy Elliott. Warm. Okay. Okay, so this is just rough. not as warm as Ashanti, I'd say. Okay. Uh, hmm. 
Hmm. I just feel like we're running back some of the same ones, huh? Only so Tatiana many celebrities. Lee. We also haven't said The Godfather yet. Um, you got Mook in hell right now, <laughs> trying to rack his brain. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm struggling. Um, I'll do Little Kim again. Warm. Well, yeah. Yeah. Same. Yeah. Okay. You know it, Brandon. Uh, kind of. I think maybe. Doja Cat. Colder. Fuck. Venus Williams. Mm, colder. Damn it. Kelly Rowland. Pretty, pretty, pretty hot. Michelle from Destiny's Child. Same temp, same hot. Nice, nice, steamy bath. Ooh. So we're in the bath and enjoying ourselves now. Mm-hmm. You're splish splashing around. Macy Gray. A mm, little bit, a co- little bit colder. Beyonce Knowles, aka hot, Beyonce. Hot. Hot. Oh fuck! <laughs> <laughs> we can uh, after twenty, everybody can just throw out group talk. Uh, well, I got one. Ice spice. You said that last round, didn't Jesus. you? Yes, I did. Oh no, no, I think you said Doja Cat. Um, <laughs> cold her. Is it Lisa Left Eye Lopez? Uh, rest in peace. But no, but uh, warm, hot. I feel like Destiny's Child was hotter well, than TLC. TLC. Is, uh, no, no, I'm yeah. not saying you're wrong. I'm, I'm, it was. It is, that's what I'm trying to talk you through, Brandon. So it's a female it's not, group around that era. Yes. Okay. Destiny's Child was hot. Yeah. TLC was uh, pretty hot. So what's another female group around that era? I feel like Destiny, Destiny's Child like only, only came with that. I like from the era, but, but yeah, the group thing's a good point. Hmm. Uh, I, want, I mean, Maya... Hot, not as hot. Solange Knowles. Colder. That would have been steaming with Beyonce. Yeah. Mel B. Scorching. Uh, oh, okay. All right. All right. Good. 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 <laughs> Who is Mel B? Spice, Spice Girl. Girl. Who's the one married to to back to back? Ah, uh, that is Posh Spice. Mm. Scorching. <laughs> All right, Mook. Hurts to put the toe in. <laughs> <laughs> uh, th- so there's Posh. Yep. There's. Uh huh. I already did Ice. Uh, no, there's not. <laughs> I know. <laughs> ice Spice. <laughs> Who is Would the other? Would you like me to run through the spices for yes, you? Yes, please. Yeah. Sporty. Okay. Scary. Posh. Baby. And Ginger. Give me Ginger. Scorching. Sporty. Scorching. <laughs> <laughs> Scary Spice. Scary Spice. Yay! Wow. All right. Guess Good teamwork, 29. boys. Good what teamwork. So for future, do does like name count as hotness? Like if they I share didn't. a first name? I didn't. Okay. Yeah. Because Ice Spice could have been. It could have been, but I feel right. like I would have thrown off more. Yeah. yeah. Would you I'm guys have gotten Bindi Irwin? I almost <laughs> went with Bindi Irwin. <laughs> I know her. So okay. It maybe in the hundreds. <laughs> okay. What? This is so fun. Yeah, Who wants to be a celebrity guy now? Time. Titus, you want to be a celebrity? I'll do guy? it. Yeah, I got one. Um, you ready? Mook, Mook wouldn't know this person though. Okay, but I think well, he hasn't known any of them. Yeah, hold yeah, on. Um, yeah. He's got ice spice in his back pocket. <laughs> yeah. Mook's sneaky Wait, young. Hold on, let me think of a different one. Yeah, I was thinking that too. Actually. I have. Okay, I have one. I have one. All right. I have one. Okay. Who's... Jay, start us off. Yeah. Titus is going. Titus is the yep. question yep. guy. Um. Mm. Let's go with um, Sally Jesse Raphael. <laughs> Who the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> <laughs> he was just so excited. The, the woman Ninja Turtles. Dude. No, 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 no. Okay, can I just take a time out and say the one that I initially thought of was Geraldo Rivera? <laughs> <laughs> and then I thought, I don't know if that's. <laughs> Same that, that's who immediately came to mind. But did, and for you to guess that first. <laughs> Wait, so the last, the, la- the last one, sorry, was Scary Spice? Yes. Yeah. Is scary that Mel B? Spice. Is Mel B Scary oh, Spice? Shit. Yeah, it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like, oh, shit. Is I Mel B Scary Spice? Down. Holy shit. I, think wow. I, didn't know, I didn't know Scary Spice is real name. Oh, man. I get him confused. So we really should have got like 26 on that. So Yeah, fuck. You got me good. I really don't know. Is it is it Mel B Scary, scary Spice? I thought Mel B was Ginger. That's my turn to guess. Right? Victoria uh, Beckham was Posh? Yeah. 
What what did you say again, Shay? <laughs> Sally, Sally Jesse, Jesse Raphael. Um. Oh, Mel B's scary. Shit, I think. Scary. Uh, a, 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 a slightly cold. What do you say? The lukewarm. I'll Sally call Jesse lukewarm. Raphael I'll is call lukewarm. Lukewarm. Okay. lukewarm. What is Sally Jesse? She Raphael? was the host of the Sally Show. She was a. a can you just? She was a talk show host. Okay, I've heard Thank of her. She was like Oprah. She was in the era of Oprah, Ricky Lake, Montel Williams. Um, who was the Geraldo? Thank you. There were a bunch of them back then. Jerry Springer. Same, like lukewarmish. Wow. I will go. Um, Anderson Cooper. Uh, I would classify that as hot. I would classify that. Yo, dude, well done. Bro. I would classify that as hot. Now what? Very hot. What made it very, very hot? Very, very hot. Okay. Um, Newscaster. Tucker Carlson. Colder. Hmm. Then Anderson Cooper. Okay. I forget. Like, what do you want me to do about this? Do we do? I think I, you always compare to your the last just the, your the, person. The, okay. Uh, then yeah, lukewarm. Okay. Anderson Cooper's hot. So he really liked Anderson Cooper. He did not like Tucker Carlson. Okay. As much. Larry King. Warm. John Stewart. Lukewarm. Don Lemon. What? Well, you just skipped. Che. Oh, Che, I'm sorry, bro. You That's okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um. Che, say Don Lemon. <laughs> no. Who's the. Uh, <laughs> The CNN person, his brother is like the mayor. Mm. Mm-hmm. Uh, Chris Cuomo. Uh, I would be shocked if it were Chris Cuomo. Lu- lukewarm. Okay. Okay. Do I do I lose a guess because I did? No, 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 you're, no, 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 no. You're, you're good. You're good. Go ahead. Um, well, I'm going to change my guess then. I think. Uh, to Piers Morgan. L- l- lukewarm. I'm still. This is I don't know where we are. I don't know any of the differences of. I don't know where we are right now. Andy Cohen. Very hot. Wow, dude. Okay. Very, very hot. Nick, MVP. Can you help me a little bit? So gay. What does he host? They they do the New Year's Eve broadcast together with uh with a- Anderson Cooper. Ryan. Does Ryan Seacrest do it with him? I don't know actually. Anderson Cooper. Andy so Cohen. gay, pop culturey, fun, but left. Perez Hilton. <laughs> <laughs> The fat Jewish. It's a person. I don't know a comparable one to Andy Cohen. So I'm going to uh, say Ryan Seacrest to pass it along down the line. Very hot. So is it, is uh, it somebody from the New Year's Eve broadcast? Could be American. I don't know. Simon Cow. Lukewarm. Uh oh. Way to fucking go, man. Carson Daly. Yes. V- v- hot, I believe. So we're looking at a homosexual host. (laughs) 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 I'm trying to talk this out. (laughs) Homosexual TV host. So Seacrest ish, and Cohen ish. Yeah, this should be easy. Um. Hmm. Uh, James Corden. Oh, wait, he's not gay, right? <laughs> <laughs> um, lu- Luke war- warm, Luke warm. Yeah, I don't really have anybody. I can only like envision sort of ro- live ro- Rockefeller Center broadcast. Yeah, Al Roker, pretty fucking hot. Matt Lauer, pretty hot. Yeah, like oh. hot, warm, w- very warm. I got. I got. No. Do we all know who this is? I don't. Yeah, know. You all know who this is, and this is frustrating the fuck out of me. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't got this already. I. I, I don't. Because really... you've all said like the key bullet points of like I'm thinking like who ABC, this guy's like, Good Morning Show type identity is type shit. Michael Strahan. Warm. <laughs> Matt Lauer. Seacrest was hot. Seacrest is. I very don't know. Hot. I'm trying to think of like morning show people. Wait, what does Seacrest do? Hosts he everything. He hosts New Year's Eve. He hosts everything. Uh, oh, uh, not Conan. Who's the piano guy? What? 
Billy Joel? No, who's the guy that is also on Conan? What's his name? Oh, his little sidekick? Yeah. Andy Richter? He doesn't play the piano. Oh, I thought he did. (laughs) (laughs) They had Max Weinberg, the drummer. I want to say Andy Richter. Is that a bad guess? It feels bad. It feels terrible. Um, Jimmy Fallon? Mm, warm. Lukewarm, warm. Oh, I'm running out of gas. Yeah, yeah Brandon, this is this is embarrassing for you. For me? Yeah. So New Year's Eve, Dick Clark. Dick Clark. Wow. Dick fucking Clark. Wow. There it is. I don't know Dick, Dick Clark. Clark. <laughs> it's called Dick Clark's New Year's Rock and Eve. That's the he he did it for years, and that's what Ryan Seacrest hosts, I believe. Got it. Yeah. yeah. I'm sorry. I thought this is a fun fucking game. Yeah. I thought Dick Clark was. No, it's probably a great. I just don't know anything about anything. <laughs> so that's, that's a. It's a tough one. For I'm me. genuinely stupid. <laughs> yeah, that's a that's a big handicap. Julia. <laughs> All right, I got one. Oh, you got one. You want to pick one? All right, Kyle, go. Was it? Well, hold on. Did I fuck up by picking a dead guy? No. Oh, Did you're that fine. throw you off? But that's yeah. on that's on the board now. That's completely on the board. I thought. Yeah. I don't know. I thought Dick Clark was. Mm-hmm. Kind of a. Uh... Kyle, you got us here. I got one. Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, no. Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah. That hurts. Oh, it it up too. The oh. fact that there's a dap being given in the fucking live feed of that, too. You see it, boom. Hurts. <laughs> that's, that's what hurts way worse. Happens to me like once a week, dude. Uh, hurts. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. sorry I'm sorry. <laughs> I know you didn't. I, uh, before Kyle does his, you want to read the high noon ad? Can you hand her to me? I, I sure can. Actually, I need to hand you both sheets for that. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, folks at home, high noon. The high noon El Prez pack is here featuring the top four high noon vodka seltzer flavors. As ranked by El Prez himself, these flavors include passion fruit, pineapple, pear, and an all new flavor, tangerine. All made with real vodka and real juice. The 12 pack is only here for a limited time. So get it while you can. Just look for the pack with Dave's face on it. You can scan the QR code on the pack and have El Prez virtually join your party. Visit HighNoonSpirits.com to find the El, the El Prez. I was so close to having a flawless you average. Had it. The El Prez pack nearest you. Yep. Shout out to uh, Miss Peaches. I keep, oh, get, yeah. I keep getting tagged in those tweets being like, this dog has a better life than you. And I'm like, I <laughs> Dog has a better life than all of us. All of us. Yeah, yeah it's by not far. Just me. Yeah. Not even close, and and she seems to have settled into her her life very quickly. She seems to be relaxed and and everything. I I wonder how old she is. She looks like a he's he's rescued a, you know an older dog. I like that. I that that's awesome. Six. Six. Wow. Yeah. wow. That's what a what a come up for. What her. a come up, man. Yeah. Never Senior quit your dog. dreams. You know? Never quit. Never quit. <laughs> Keep going. All right, Kyle. We're gonna start with Titus. You got one. Yeah. <sighs> Titus, get us started. Uh. Let's go with uh, Olivia Rodrigo. Mm-hmm. Cold. AJ Hawk. <laughs> Reasonably cool. Okay. Slash cold. Fuck. Slash cold. Okay. Um, I can only think of one type of celebrity now. Um, John Mayer. (laughs) (laughs) Cold, but visually, um, appearance-wise, not too cold. Pretty warm. Okay. But not, but also very cold at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> You'll understand. Um, Elliot Page, lukewarm. Mm-hmm. Bill Hader, <laughs> uh, cooler. Room temperature. Idris Elba, <laughs> cold. Yeah, you're colder. John Stamos. That's a good guess. Um, <laughs> That's good. It's cool. 
What about all these clips you could just take out of context? <laughs> yeah. And John Stamos, he's like, cool. Yeah, yeah, he's, he's cool. He's cool. <laughs> Hulk Hogan. Um, colder, getting colder. So, visually kind of similar to John Mayer. And I'm going to have to see a side-by-side but after not, this to confirm that. Not super. <laughs> you don't know? <laughs> not super perfect. Yeah, I think they... Feels so, like not a musician. White guys that sort of look like John Mayer, but don't look like John Because if it was a musician that looks like John Mayer, he would have gone red fucking hot, probably. Right. So yeah. it's not... So yeah. Music's out. So it's out. nowhere in... Could be an athlete. Yeah. I'm thinking Eli Manning. Could be an Elmer has tattoos. Yeah, but he's still dark hair. Yeah. Dark hair. Tall, skinny, white dude. Jimmy Garoppolo. Uh, athletically, you're on Neptune. <laughs> <laughs> Chaz Bono. Huh. It's cold. Hmm. Mick Jagger? Freezing cold. Huh. Hmm. Jason Mraz. <laughs> <laughs> I like the way you said it. Uh, still cold. He says. Athletically on Neptune says, compared to Jimmy G. <laughs> so it's not an athlete. Not an athlete. But probably a white guy who's not a musician or an athlete. Well, it makes you think it's a guy. Mm. Every single guy has been called. Elliot Page. He said he looks like. John He said he looks like. The person looks like John Mayer. It could be. Yeah. A woman that looks like John Mayer. Mm-hmm. You'll forgive me if you say that he looks like John. That the person. Yeah, looks yeah. Like oh, John I'm Mayer not seeing strategy I'm... going on right now. Wait, I'm just trying to cover we... all the bases. Twelve guys in, they've all been called. John, well, teacher, what are we doing? He said he's John. Mayer. It looks like John Mayer. People look like people all the time. <laughs> people look like. All right. People. Uh, Got a point. Jane Lynch. Well, how would you know what she looks like? <laughs> yeah. That I mean, if you're going a woman, that would be. Closer, but cold. So it's not a woman. Because it's not a woman. Back to a man. Well, thank you for taking that bullet for us. Do all of us know who this is? It was a horrible idea. It was a a, a guy. Yes. What's up? But um, you probably don't know his real name. (laughs) (laughs) What? I I sure don't. (laughs) (laughs) I hate you. I hate you. What does that mean? That's insane. I'll leave it at that, but he's very gettable. Okay. (laughs) And people he's scorching hot with are are very gettable. I'll say that. Okay. People he's scorching hot with. (laughs) All right, Mook. And he also, okay, all right. Um, Kevin from The Office. (laughs) In a way, uh, hot. Oh. Okay. But not um, – well, I guess we'll go very hot in some categories, <laughs> but but otherwise still lukewarm. All right, it's a fatty. Oh, no, it's I a think, big I think, old I boy. Think it's a fatty. I, I think it's a – You think it's a fatty? Uh-uh. You don't think it's an office? Is it an office? No, I think it's somebody who may be developmentally uh, slower. <laughs> oh. Why do you think that? Oh. Kevin from The Office was – Okay. All right. All right. So – <laughs> but he doesn't know his name. I need to think of a possibly fictional person that looks like John Mayer that could be <laughs> special needs. <laughs> and that's not athletic. Dave Portnoy? <laughs> oh, cold. Oh Mr. Beast. Pretty good. Uh, Cold. Hmm. I love that guess. Mr. Bean. Warm. Okay. <laughs> How did Mr. Beast to Mr. Bean? <laughs> a guy whose real name we don't not, know. Not too warm, though. Rowan Atkinson. <laughs> Could it be very hot from the office? Could it be like Creed Bratton? Yeah, cooler. Mm-hmm. What? Fake name things throughout. I'm more confused than I was before. Oh, that. yeah. Yep. You don't know his real name. Does that mean that he has some fake name in life? Yeah. Wh- Stage I don't, I don't name. Know if I can act, Stage. if I can answer that. Right. Uh, uh, was that an oh, I know it? Oh. Maybe, but we could be on the right track here. Is it like the Mayhem guy? 
could be mayhem. The mayhem guy. <laughs> uh, mayhem? You've gotten his profession a few times. Okay. Then I know it. <sighs> I don't know. But then... Hmm. What what profession do we think it is, then? I don't said a lot of musicians. So it is a musician. I also think act. But then John Mayer would have been hotter than... Yeah. Who was the hottest? He said, and Julia said Mick Jagger, and he was like, oh, no. The office guy was the hottest one yet, right? Okay. Kevin was. I think it's an actor. So we think it's an actor. And what about Kevin from The Office? I think think his radar went off when we did like like a character esque person that isn't easily recognized. I'll try, I'll try another big boy. John Candy. So that's, that's colder. Okay. So. So the key here is that we don't really know his real name. So it could be a mascot. Hold on. Do we not know his real name or does Kyle not know his real name? You guys might. Oh, yeah. Kyle, I texted you, I guess. Is that right? <laughs> <laughs> then, no. Fuck. No, but I appreciate DJ, it. DJ, you can also guess. Yeah, what was it? He guessed Beetlejuice. Oh, that which is, um, I would say, warm in a way. Yeah, I would say warm. I would say Kevin's a little closer. See. Is it like a sitcom character? Jake from State Farm. Cold. Oh, I like that, though. Yeah, I could guess. I think we we just start throwing out guesses now. We don't really have to go the turns yeah. based because I have nothing. So Beetlejuice and Kevin from The Office, again, both a yeah. little stunted. Mm-hmm. Is, it, is it someone we talked about yesterday? No. Am I allowed to ask that? And you know his crew. <laughs> well, I know people you'd guess that I would answer with scorching hot. Ron Swanson? Uh, pretty cool. <sighs> now it's almost time. Yeah. kind of making me mad. Yeah, I'm getting a little frustrated. frustrated. The Edge from U2. Cold. Okay. What about the naked uh, We know him. The guy from we, Red Hot Chili Peppers. No, Colder. We know him as his Lee? character name, but I don't think people really know his act his the his actor name. I have an idea. Okay. You Is can it say. my turn to Julia go? You can go. I guess yeah, I went. Uh Jaleel White, aka Steve Urkel. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's still Wait, 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 wait. Still lukewarm, but wait. Oh my god. Screech. I pretty hot. Okay. I'm gonna need some but not too hot. <laughs> <laughs> uh I think this is gonna be dumb. This is Kramer. Mm, pretty warm, but cool. Scott Farkas. From <laughs> you just skipping me now? From uh, we, we just it's all it's uh, all oh oh it's television oh, oh so I'll say it's television. Uncle Joey. Mm. Well, see that's the problem Dave with Coulier. that show. That he was never called Uncle Joey. It was Uncle Jesse and Joey. Joey was just the best friend of Danny. He was never what really called an uncle. <sighs> Carlton. We can't go double, double, double Fresh Prince. Fresh Prince. Old. We I mean. No, Julio, we can't it's fucking a, go. A, double it's a, <laughs> fucking it's not a comedy show. It's not a sitcom. It's a, but it's a very, very popular show. Does anybody watch Succession? Is it the? Is it Chrissy Metz? Is it Brand? Cold. Is it Brand? Hodor. Cold. Logan Roy. Yes, from the booth. Cold. Yes. Yeah. Uh, from Za. Walt Jr. Walt Jr. Oh! Yeah, good shit, Za. Come on. <laughs> Who's Walt Jr.? Oh, uh, my bad. If you did. Pul- oh, fuck, you haven't seen Breaking Bad. It's no. the palsy, son. Yeah, oh, that was man. a little hard. <laughs> God he was, uh, damn it. He was, he was oh, a Gap model days. briefly, too. See, Jack, Jack so got it like 10 minutes. They ago. got it quick? They got it super He kind of looks like John Mayer, but not too far yeah, off. Yeah, kind of looks like <laughs> Jacob Elordi, doesn't he? He kind of looks like a hot guy. I think he is a hot he guy. He looks like he is hot. Yeah. yeah we should have got that. He's sexy. That was good. What a game. <laughs> Fire has always had a sidekick. Smoke. But we hate that guy. It stinks. It burns your eyes. It makes everyone cough. Yep, it's no good. Solo Stove comes along and pulls off a miracle by kicking Senior Smoke to the curb. That's right. They made fire without smoke. Put in terms we're more familiar with, a regular fire with smoke is the butt fumble 
and Solo Stove is the helmet catch. No more having your hair and clothes smell like burnt logs. They come in different sizes, but the most popular, and our personal favorite here on the Yak, is called Bonfire. It's a great size for backyard hangs, but also super portable, making it perfect for tailgating. They make some really cool high heat ceramic coated colors too, plus a bunch of accessories like cast iron griddle and grill cooktops for serving up game day brats and a heat deflector for extra warmth for your crew. Titus, you're in the new house, but yep. it is it is winter. I assume yep. when March or April gets here, you're going to get out there with the solo it's stove. A, yeah, I got the solo stove ready. Do you have a backyard? Ish. Yeah. You it's got a, room for the, the city, solo stove. So, but I do have a nice little patio situation that we'll get the solo stove set up on. Each pit is backed by a lifetime warranty, and you can even get them etched with your favorite NFL team. Head over to solostove.com. Use promo code BARSTOOL20. That's barstool two zero. To get twenty bucks off a hundred dollar nine hundred ninety nine dollar, hmm. use code. Uh, I'm going to start the entire last part over. All right, brother. All right. <laughs> Head over to solostove.com. Use promo code Barstool twenty. That's Barstool two zero to get twenty bucks off your order of a hundred ninety nine dollars or more and ditch the smoke for good. Solo stove. Thank you, boys. Sweet. Got through. All right. Uh, does the game run its course? Do Walt Junior so. look like Malasek? Yeah. Who, who's that? Yeah, Walt He Jr. does look like Malasek. Like What's his name? R.J. Mitt? That's it. Yeah, I can see your... Wait, did he, was he in prison? I can see your John Mayerness to it. Did, did Walt Jr. go to... Oh, it's uh, just yeah. the Q-Zip. He does look like <laughs> Jacob. Oh, you didn't recognize the Q-Zip? I didn't know how far... It's cropped. Does the actor have palsy? Yeah. Or palsy a little bit, but he's pretty... F he ups it. Yeah, he just plead did it, Plays ammed it up. I think he dated game. Miley Cyrus. Did he? Yeah. Really? I think so. I heard about that. R.J. Mitt. R.J. Mitt. He has Miss cerebral palsy. Yeah. Huh. Jackson, Mississippi. Jackson, Jackson Mississippi. Mississippi. I'll be goddamn. Damn. <laughs> Delivered by an emergency cesarean. Oh. Not breathing at the time of his... Jesus Christ. So this is and the, he was adopted? It's a miracle. Sad story. Fitted with leg braces and crutches. Huh. Raised by his mother. And then his mother became paralyzed. Jesus uh, Christ, uh, buddy. Yeah. We're a pro Mitt show. All right. RJ. Wait, God. he be he became financially responsible for the family at thirteen? Oh. He's a star. Oh. He's this a, fucking he's guy. A he's a star. All right. Thank you. Legend. Uh, what else we got, boys? Uh, let's see what the other. How was your Valentine's Day? <laughs> I'll let you know in the chat that we're starting. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> You'll be getting an update from me. And what is your favorite workout song? I'll check out on this one. Uh, Not Letting Go by Tiny Tempa and Jess Glenn, the XY Constant Remix. Okay. Nice. Thanks. So I will check those out later. Mm -hmm. um, Brandon, what would your walkout song in wrestling be then? <sighs> Probably uh, Country Shit by Big Crit. Okay. Oh, nice. Has anybody ever done Running That's with nice. the Devil by Van Halen? I don't know if they have, mm. um, but I uh, I don't really even know that song. Oh. it's one of the, I feel like that's one of those songs, if I hear it, I know exactly what it is, yeah, but I, I can't think of it off the top of my head. Jay, what was yours be? You you immediately perked up. Oh no, I was gonna. I was just nodding that you will know that song as soon as you hear it. Yeah. Um, mine would be um, "Runaway" by Bon Jovi, but instrumental. Oh. I would do "La Difficile" by Bad Bunny. You're the biggest Bad Bunny fan. I always big forget Bad that. Didn't did Bad Bunny do that as his walkout? I don't know if that song. Actually, no. I think he had a song called Booker T, which may have been. Yeah, his. but no, no, no. He he was the main event of the uh, of a pay per view in Puerto Rico. That was the coolest that. walkout I've ever seen. And I don't know his, what song he. The fans song? just sang his song to him as he walked out. It was kind of like. Uh, baila, baila, oh, chambea, baila, 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 baila. yeah, yeah. They would. Uh, All right. That's, that's I sick. I was watching that music video today. Ric Flair is in the music video. He dated Kendall Jenner, and neither of them spoke each other's language, and they were dating for <laughs> he years. English. Oh, he speaks English. He does, right? Because I think he does promos he in English, English for for, yeah. for wrestling. He's actually in the wrestling world very respected because he he bought into it a lot. I heard that he he crushed it. He like dove in and like 
legitimately learned how to wrestle. Well, I think he was a longtime fan, but he le- him and Logan Paul are like the two. Puerto Rico is a huge wrestling. Huge. Like, they had oh, that it show. Is? Yeah. It was the best show of all, all of last year. They had it in April, I think, after Did you see his walkout? No, but I heard he was great. He, he was fantastic. He was also good in Bullet Train. He was. Oh, yeah. yeah. He packs, he too. He seems like a very likable guy. Yeah. He might so be cool. like behind Taylor Swift as the top American star if you count Puerto Rico, which you, you do. If you count streams, I think he's right up there. I think he's there, way up there, there right? Yeah. He, so. I, I, did I see he was the most streamed artist in the world last year or something like I that? I could see that. I think so. I, at one point, like when his album came out, every song was the top stream song of the year at the time when it came out. Nobody listens to music like Spanish speakers. Which is sick. Uh, yeah, they go so hard. They also rip YouTube hard, dude. That really? They, yeah. they put the they get the numbers. Every up. Uber like has a has like of TV playing YouTube in it <laughs> in like Latin America. It's crazy. God damn. Yeah. Yeah. Badass. Bad Bunny. Bad Bunny. I might go watch that entrance today. It was it was very very. It was cool, and they went to the shopping cart. Yeah. His fit was cool too. He had the like almost the the vest, the tactical vest. Yeah. Or something like that. Yeah, that was a good show. Awesome show. Um. All right. Can I ask you guys a question? Please. Okay. This, I was thinking, and please don't answer saying that you feel this way about me. <laughs> and I don't, I didn't feel this way about any of you. But I think it's hurtful when somebody says to me, when I first met you, I didn't like you. Hate that. Yeah. Or I didn't want to like you. It's that hurtful. One's a weird one too. Uh-huh. Yeah, that's like a, a, like a, a dumb asshole move. Yeah. It's a remarkably unnecessary thing to say. On paper, I shouldn't <laughs> like you. Yeah. It's hurtful. So, yeah. Like it brings me back to that time where I'm I'm now re-experiencing right. this way you felt about me that I didn't know. If you take out the intro, the preamble, it's the sentence. The message he wants to get across is, "I like you," but right. when you start it with, "I used to not like you," or "I didn't want to like you," or "Against my better judgment, I like you." But why? Well, yeah, yeah. That's a weird. That happens a lot. Yeah, to, yeah. I get that hurtful. tweet five times a day. Yeah, like, that, that's the, yeah. I, I, <laughs> Yeah, I really do. No, I just mostly get I fucking hate you. <laughs> <laughs> I always wanted to hate you. Yeah, and I get I that. <laughs> Ever since I saw you, no? I knew I fucking despised you. <laughs> like it's someone you're typically actively friends with. Yeah, uh, and they're like, dude, like you're having a nice moment, and then they bring that out, it, and it just like gives me this. It just brings me yeah. back there the way a song from an era does. And they like tell you the ick. They're like, this is yeah. what you did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It or is just weird. like I heard that this or like. I believe. Yeah, they that. basically are saying the impression you give off, which who you that's who you are to the vast majority of people is horrible. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you really have to get to like you have to be a good friend. Right. I get to appreciate. I have to really get to know you. Right. I've Titus is an acquired oh, actually, taste. I, I, Titus I have, is an acquired <laughs> taste. I have resting bitch face. <laughs> <laughs> He's an acquired taste. I am. I I have resting bitch face, so people think I'm like just always fucking angry. Does that extend to uh-huh. like a second person? Like if I were to say Wait, what's the face, Titus? What's kinda, the face that you always make? Oh, the are you talking about the what's, sexy what's your rest, face? What's your resting face? My re- I'm just kind of like this more often than not. <laughs> God, that's awesome. No, just, <laughs> if I were to take a picture, and it looks right like now. it looks like I'm angry, and I'm I'm really not. I'm just like thinking of what's for lunch. <laughs> Pensive. <laughs> so does it extend like if you're introducing somebody or if you're telling somebody about somebody and you say, "Yeah, hey, Nick's a good guy." Once you get to know him, you're gonna like him. Yeah, yeah. I, I would say that's a milder form, okay. but like also yeah. hurtful he's an acquired taste that's mean and like a lot of people would just be like yeah but he's like he's that asshole no it's just an <laughs> asshole <laughs> mm-hmm. right but but it made me think of this if someone says so and so used to not like you mm-hmm. if they tell someone else's story about not liking you equally hurtful yeah yeah i don't want to know that my feelings get hurt really easily maybe we're just all assholes <laughs> in the world <laughs> Yeah. yeah, I hate when they put it on you that you've ch- like I used to like you, but man, like the last couple of weeks you've been awesome, and you're like I've been the same fucking person the whole time, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You piece of shit. <laughs> I, I never changed anything. I met uh, at the dozen trivia event. I met Greg Olson for the first time, and I told him when he was started in the booth, I didn't really like him. That's no, awesome. you didn't. That's just an easy thing to say. Yeah. No, no, no. But then I was like, but actually, I've come around. I think you're really, That's really good. Exactly That's exactly what we just what talked Greg Olson's been is, fantastic the whole Greg Olson has uh, been disagree. the exact same the entire time, Jay. I, I think he's gotten a lot better. No, he hasn't. He's been the exact why same. Why say that to him? Well, yeah. yeah, I don't think you really Why not just say, hey, Greg, you're awesome in the booth? Yeah. I wanted to show progress. I mean, oh, so yeah, for your own benefit. You want to show your own progress? You wanted to show that you're like 
you're enlightened somehow that like you you've gone through this journey of like learning something new about yeah all i think those yeah. you people and i like, think i think I, it's fair to say a guy got better uh two years into his job than his first day on the job but everybody probably has that that's just that's just okay but what if you speak in the present hey man speak in the present you are awesome at your job i think you subconsciously wanted to bring him down a peg no, I already did. I, I first apologized to him that I called his uh, coat horrific and that the New York Post wrote an article about it. He did he even know you did that? Oh, yeah. The, wait, wait. <laughs> well, I told him it was me, and he was like, oh, you're that oh, fucking he guy. <laughs> the New York Post? Why even do that? The New York Post wrote an article about you calling Greg Olson's oh coat horrific? Yes. <laughs> there was a – his tweet was in the article. Was no, it? the the whole article was about <laughs> – that uh, was an article. TJ, New York Post will write anything. anything I know that, but uh, they usually do it about Dave or no, Chicken but I, Fry. So but I, I felt bad because in the article, it was like Greg Olson, when Reach for Comment was like, yeah, my wife picked it out. And I was like, hey, man, I just want to say I'm really sorry. I didn't mean to cause any problems at home. I was just kind of busting chops. I bet you didn't cause problems at home. NFL fans. Rip Greg Olson's horrendous jacket during Ravens-Lions game. And the horrendous is Che's quote. Wow. <laughs> I mean, you know, it's a brutal coat. You know what? I mean, <laughs> it's a rough coat. This is one of your better coat tweets. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you didn't try to make it a, a, an allegory or a something. You what Che did to me isn't as painful. You said you caused problems at home. <laughs> <laughs> I, I said I apologize <laughs> if I did that. He didn't mean to cause problems at home. <laughs> I'm sorry if you... <laughs> Craig Holson's wife left. Your wife yeah, he went He went. wife didn't leave you because you're your coat, right? <laughs> like, I just... Because I didn't like your coat. <laughs> yeah, it's not as, as bad if you're like I didn't like you, but you don't. It's bad. No, but if you don't know them personally, like I, I would, I prefer that to somebody who's known me the whole time, like someone I know personally, as opposed if they're like, yeah, when I first saw you on whatever, I thought you were a tool, but now I like you. Like I'm, I actually enjoy that compliment. That's a big thing in stand up. People were like, I didn't think you guys were gonna be funny at all, but we had a great time at the show. Like, yeah, yeah. I don't know. I don't know that one as much. Oh, me, and, me, and, <laughs> me and Sass get it like every really? weekend. We're okay. Like, bro, it's probably because you guys are young, touring. People just assume you don't have chops, and then they're pleasantly surprised. Yeah. Yeah. That's cool. It's good. Yeah, that's got to feel good, bro. <laughs> yeah. This weekend, the Barstool Sports tailgate in the Midway at Daytona International Speedway is on Saturday, February 17th. You'll have Barstool guys like Spider and Lars from Rubbing His Racing. KFC and Fights will be there. Joey and Pat from Out and About will be there. They'll be there to see Dwayne The Rock Johnson, who's the Grand Marshal of this year's Daytona 500. They'll be there to see a pre-race concert featuring Pitbull. Your star drivers right now in NASCAR, Ryan Blaney, Chase Elliott, Denny Hamlin, Ross Chastain, Bubba Wallace, and more. Make sure to watch NASCAR Full Speed on Netflix. I started to watch that last night, but I, I was about to fall asleep, so I didn't want to launch into it. But the... The little, you know, when you hover on something on Netflix and they play the little yeah. herb, it was interesting. All right, very interesting. Um, you can watch your favorite drivers before they take on the Daytona 500. It's 500 miles, 200 laps on the two and a half mile long track. It is the most iconic race in motorsports. The Daytona 500 starts at 2:30 p.m. Eastern this Sunday, February 18th, on Fox. Again, the Daytona 500, the most iconic race in motorsports, is finally here. Tune in on February 18th, 2:30 p.m. Eastern. On Fox. All right. Um, TJ, you want to go ahead and get the wheel ready? Yeah. Well, well, well and Julia, how many tickets do you have left for the two shows? Under 50 for both? I th yeah, I think there's like under 50 total left uh, tomorrow night. The Wicker Den Park Theater. Wicker Park would be fun. Wicker Park, 715, 930. Uh, yeah, if you're in the Chicago area, please buy now. Buy now. Please buy them. Yeah, they've and if you have a kiss coin on the Yak, yeah. mm -hmm. I'll be there. Kyle, you going? Yeah. Mook, you going? I get on the list? Yeah, sure. There we go. There we go. There. Yeah. You guys come come steal a kiss. 100%. Oh. Uh, coming soon, the head and pussy coin from the yak. That's right. <laughs> That's right. And you have to flip it in front of us and see what it lands on. <laughs> uh, has it ever? Has the inverse ever happened where I've been like, uh, I guess this is maybe when you the relationship's over or something. But, and you know, at first I really liked you, but you're a fucking dick. I guess that's just a fight or an argument. Yeah. Yeah. People uh, never really say that, though. It really is. Hey, at first, every yeah. relationship yeah. starts off that I liked you and then I don't like yeah, you. Yeah, I think I think what you're describing is just a breakup and then you just never talk to that person. No, not a breakup. I think you just live the rest of your life loathing that person together. Yeah. Marriage. Marriage. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah, I guess it's like common enough that it doesn't require pointing out specifically. So I saw that yesterday the stat that 50% of 
people think that 50% of marriages end in divorce, but 50% of first marriages end in divorce, but the rate is way higher for second and third marriage. Divorce rate? Of divorce rate is? No, the, the, the rate of success oh, interesting. Is, ver- is way higher. So you think it should be like chicken pox and we should all get married young? I think you then, get it out of the way. Yeah. yeah. You, get one, you have a practice. We'll one. have a marriage party. when It's it, like the yeah. challenge, dude. Second go, you're going to have a better time. I've never watched the challenge. <laughs> no, but I'm saying this challenge. Gauntlet. Oh, I thought oh. you meant the show. Are you feeding to go again? No, dude. No, no. It kind of seems like you are. Seems like you. I, you know, there's things I would have done differently, but I'm worried that if I were to do it again, that I'd be much worse. Yeah. You keep your best time. That would be embarrassing. Malasek was probably up late last night. <laughs> Valentine's Day. Sending selfies to chicks. <laughs> With his dog. With did, his dog. Did we do that on this show, or the, was that the show that we looked at this dog selfie? That was. That was the show. I, my shows run together. I yeah, yeah. It's quite the dog selfie. Your shows. Our shows. Sorry. Whatever. Um. Were you on, were you on Mincy this morning? What? No, was that I? yesterday morning? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Um, Maybe I was, man. I don't. <laughs> I'm on that show a lot. You are. We got to get him on the tennis court, man. Oh, I want to see. Now that. I need to see. I, yeah. I want to see his skills. He, he uh, today? He no, I think he's in. He think he left. I think he's in mourning because the widespread panic concert got postponed. Yeah. Oh, oh no. shit. You know, How long has oh. it been since he's seen widespread Bummer. panic? Probably a week and a half, two weeks, or well, whenever <laughs> he was in Richmond, right? Yeah. So, oh. um. They're not coming to Chicago now. Now he's going to have to wait till February 20, 28th, I think. Where is now that? We're, no, excuse me. We are going to have to wait until. Did they February. postponed it? Oh, yeah. yeah you were I was going. going with yeah. it. How are you doing? Not great. This was, I was excited for this. Um, yeah. Now I get to do literally anything else. And <laughs> Why was it postponed? <laughs> and uh, illness? Someone, yeah. Somebody's sick. Now, do we have a, we have a February 29th this year? Yeah. We do, yeah, yeah. 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 So, yeah, yeah. I think I think it's postponed until February 29th through the through the second of of March. Um, March is when I start thinking, okay, now it's springtime. Yep, and you always but, get fooled. But this is our first time here, and we have we have had pretty good winter. They're saying like, wait till you wake up to six inches of snow in April. Don't want to do that. Oof. Yeah, yeah. They're saying it starts in May. <laughs> Spring. I, I mean. Yeah, there's been tolerable days. This today's winter. tolerable. They've also Today's they told us in like October, wait till the winter. You're gonna. I don't need hot. I just need like I can be outside with a sweatshirt and be fine. Yeah. There was. Like, I've been. This has been like that recently though. It has. Yeah. There was a ten day stretch in winter that was. It was that, awful. That stretch oh, that was, was bad. Tough. Yeah. yeah. It was minus fifteen, yeah. minus twenty. That that sucked. But if that's it's all we fine now yeah hopefully it's these best summer city in the country that's what, what i've heard say? well i was here last year i got here two months early before everybody else and it was pretty fucking elite yeah it it's, was pretty awesome we're talking about chicago yeah you were yeah. in wisconsin <laughs> yeah, uh, i times, just thought you meant northern how many times have you been <laughs> to chicago before we moved here oh twice no no, no. I, I i went to wrigley a lot oh did you yeah yeah, I went to. I came to the city a good bit. I guess yeah, you didn't have the yak to do. You just no, kind of left I was. Us. I had nothing to do. <laughs> yeah, I guess you didn't really have anything to do. <laughs> went and saw widespread panic a bunch. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> it was awesome. Uh, all right, TJ, you want to spin the wheel? Spin the wheel. Oh no. Mm, it should be fine. <laughs> all right, tomorrow. Uh, we'll be back. We're playing a game or something? I'm going to try to think of a game. Oh, yeah. I'm going to try to think of something. A little, okay. little boozy game? Well, we'll do a boozy game. So next promises a boozy game. All right. All right. Julio, you, uh, again, one more time. Shows Friday. Thank you. Uh, two shows Friday, 7.15, 9.30, Den Theater. Uh, I think there's more tickets left for the early show than for the late show, but should be pretty fun. It's my first special, hopefully. What part of Chicago is that in? Wicker Park. Wicker Real Park. hip area. Yeah, so hopefully okay. you guys will like it. And, All right, uh, so go check him out. See you there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Thank you. All right, that's the act. Good shit. Have a great day, everybody. See you tomorrow. Love you, bye.